This portion of 17 News is brought to you by Hillcrest Air Conditioning and Sheet Metal, serving you since 1950. All right, so Weather Wednesday time when Kevin and I get to geek out together a little bit more in depth about the weather. And we've been talking all week about the start of fall. And is it Friday? Is it Saturday? It's kind of both, which is great, right, Kevin? Yeah, you know, 11.50 in the evening on Friday. I'm asleep by then, so the first uh, <laughs> fall day for me is Saturday. <laughs> me too, exactly. So what does that first day of fall mean? Well, we wanted to break it down for you. The autumnal equinox marks the beginning of the fall season for the northern hemisphere. So that happens for us in California this Friday, September 22nd at 11.50 Pacific time. Saturday, our first full day of fall across the country. During an equinox, the sun shines directly over the equator, resulting in nearly equal amounts of day and night throughout the world, except for the North and South Pole, where the sun approximately straddles the horizon for the entire day. Now, following the autumnal equinox, the sun will gradually continue to rise later and set earlier here in the Northern Hemisphere, making the days shorter and night longer. Now, the astronomical seasons, those are caused by Earth's tilt, which always points in the same direction. So as we go around the sun, the angle of sunlight that hits the Northern and Southern Hemispheres is different. Um, Meteorological seasons, though, those are guided by our annual temperature cycles. Meteorologists group the seasons into time periods that line up with our weather and our monthly calendar. So December through February, that's winter. March through May, that's spring. June through August is summer. Is summer. And as you've been able to tell, September is starting to feel like fall. October, November will as well. So now that fall is arriving, when will it start to look like fall with our leaves, Kevin? Well, with the leaves, and I'm tired of the mosquitoes, and they think the mosquitoes might be around a little bit longer. But in terms of the leaves, I've already had some of the leaves falling off my trees here in the backyard, but we're really not going to see a peak uh, for this for a while. So let's talk about uh, those leaves and when we can start to see the fall foliage around the area. And again, you can see across the U.S., uh, we usually in September, we'll see through the Rockies. Now here in California, usually it's late October and November. Now here's what the forecast is calling for uh, this year. And you can see around October 4th, we'll start to see some changes around the Bakersfield area and Kern County. And then as we continue uh, into the mid part of October, that's when we'll start to see the real foliage start. So it's going to start right around October for most of California and Kern County. And then we uh, really dig in as we head into end October, early November. So if you're like me and can't wait for the leaves to start falling off the trees, we have to wait a little bit longer, but it is on the way. And like I said, I've got a few trees in the backyard already starting to lose their leaves. So not only we've been looking at some nice temperatures, but we get to see some of the leaves fall off the trees as well. Right now. I always love that. Thank you so much, Kevin. We always enjoy our Weather Wednesdays together. And everyone at home, please stay tuned next for our Wellness yep. Wednesday segment.